hey guys it's Taps here welcome to my youtube channel i'm excited to have you join me in this tutorial in this tutorial i want to show you briefly how you can download any premium theme on your website literally for free and you can use it on your own wordpress website so right on my screen here you can see uh this is elementor.com i did a clone of this elementor landing page in my recent tutorial and I did mention in that tutorial that a lot of the fronts on this Elementor homepage here are premium fronts. So they are fronts that you won't even find available even if you want to buy them online. So the question is how do you clone this front? How do you get this front and you can use it on your website? So I'll show you briefly how you can do this literally for free. The first thing we want to do right now is to figure out what front this website uses and see how we can replicate the same front of our website i use a chrome extension called what front this is the chrome extension here so you can go to your chrome web store and then search for the extension called what font and then you can install that extension if you have it like i've just done right now i can see i can exit the extension from here so i can just move around uh any page online and then check what front uh those websites are using so as you can see here this one says iva headline and then this one say dm sans so this one is available definitely uh so you can just search around to see what front this is dm sans this is holy grow stick whatever that is let's say uh let's just work with eva headline here if i click this you can say this is eva headline and the weight is 700 the style is normal size is 72 and the line height is 86 so i uh, will just copy this let's copy this here and if we come to darfront.com is a good place to go if you're looking for front they've got fantastic fronts here that you can easily download for free so if i come here if i search for this front or you can just search a line generally you would see that this front is not available you can see zero front find here for eva headline if you search online you won't even find a place to get this front uh, so right now let's see how we can get this in front for our website so now i would come to figma figma.com so if you're very familiar with figma then i don't need to introduce figma but if you're not Figma is a ui ux platform where you can easily come and design the ui or the ux of your website before having it live as a website so it's a fantastic platform so i would be using this platform or the plugin in this platform to download this one and the plugin we're going to be using uh is called html to design so if you come here you click this you can just come to your plugins here uh for me here i have html to design here but if you have not used this plugin before you just need to come to manage plugins and once you click that you'll be able to search for this plugin here and then you should be able to have this pop up here but since i have it here i will just open it uh, so right now this plugin is free to use however it has pro element at the free you are limited to how much you can use it but for the purpose of this example the free version of this plugin is sufficient or even more than sufficient enough for us to use so right now as you can see here i want to import this website so i have elementor.com already here in your case you might just want to put the url you want to clone the front and then you have some other things here about the auto layout hyperlinks i don't want to mention this in this tutorial i have done several tutorials around this plugin if i want to check them out so i will just hit the import button and this plugin is literally trying to clone elementor.com so there's a pop-up here that says that replace missing front and that's exactly what we are trying to do we are trying to find this front and this plugin has been able to itemize three fronts here that are missing because they are premium and because they are not available there are two things here if you want to clone this page you can just easily allow this plugin continue and it will replace this uh, front here with enter which is more like a close uh, front to the missing front but what we can still do here the second thing we can do here is to download this missing front and that's exactly what we want to do and you can see i have downloaded eva headline into my computer that's quite very 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 fantastic for the purpose of this example let's just work with eva headline to see exactly how we can bring this now into our wordpress website 
I will just hit the apply button to finish up this clone. Uh, before I close down this page, let's see exactly what this plugin is able to do. So you can see two images. We can increase the resolution of these images, but let's just close this. We are not really concerned about that. And I just want to reduce this. Let us come here. Let me zoom this a bit. So you can see this is Elemental landing page here right now in our Figma design. So now uh, let's come back to our WordPress website. So this is my WordPress website here. If you have been following me for a while, you will know that I am the Elemental guy. I love to use Elemental. So if you are using Elemental and if you have Elemental Pro, this is quite very easy for you. You just need to come down to Elemental here and come to custom front here and you see here that you can just easily just add a new front for example if i come to add new up here i can just give this front a title and then i can add front variation that's super simple and easy right so uh, but the thing about this is that there are several variations that elementor pro will require from you and what we have downloaded here is a tff file so you see we have the option here for a tff file but again elementor is asking us to bring in WAV file WAV 2 file svg or eot files i would always recommend that you upload all of these variations so that you have this front optimally working for your elementor website this is if you're using elementor pro i would show you how to still use this even if you're not using elementor pro i just using the free version now we can get a free plugin to do that for us so right now, what you can do uh, after downloading this is to use a platform called Cloud Convert. So if you come to cloudconvert.com, so you can easily just come to Tools here and you can come to Front Converter. And here you can see that you can easily convert from EOT to OTF to ITF and you just need to just select your files and convert them. So you can see you can convert here, you can select your file and convert it to this. Or you can just select the file directly from here. Uh, we have Eva headline here, and then it will ask us what we want to convert this to. So we can just convert this to EOT to WF and download all of this, and then upload all of them to Elementor. And that is solved. And then you have that front available for use to you inside Elementor. Okay, right now, that's the solution for this. So in case you don't have Elementor Pro and you want to rely on something entirely free. So let's come back to WordPress and then let's come to plugins. Let's come to add new. And then let's just search custom front in the WordPress repository. And then we have this plugin here called custom front host your fronts locally. And this plugin is active already in your case. It might not be. You may just need to install and then activate this front. So if you install this plugin, you can just come to appearance and you will have a new uh, function or a new menu here for, for custom fronts. So you can just open this up. And here you have the option to add a new front. So now this would ask you for the front name. So I can just easily call this app usual. You can call it Eva, whatever you want to call it, the real name of the front, that's okay. And then you need to choose this front and then bring the front into your WordPress library. I have the front here already, Eva headline. So I can just easily click this header and then bring this website into my WordPress. And then you can see I have this here. So you can see this is the preview of this front. And this front is the same thing. As what we have here that's how super simple and easy it is for you to lay hands on any premium front out there and then you can use it on your own WordPress website so right now you can just since this is normal we can leave it as normal and this is just 700 and this is where we can also have different variations so you can see you can have different sizes different variations uh, OTF TFF WOF. you can do all that here too as well but I won't do that for the purpose of this tutorial. And then I will save this from configuration added successfully. Uh, that's it. So now we can now go into a project, a page, and then we can search for a font called DAPS. So let's experiment with that if that is possible. So I will just come to pages. 
all pages uh, this is an elementor website here so let's edit this with elementor good so we have uh, this page loaded here so i can just click this here or let's use this title here and then i can come to style i can come to typography uh poppins is here by default so i can just search for dabs so you can see i have dabs here so i can select this so you can see i now have the front here how super cool is this literally for free so this is exactly how you can download any premium uh, font out there online and then you can use it on your own wordpress website that's it that's my time for this tutorial if you find it quite very useful give me a thumbs up let me know also in the comment section if you are able to replicate the same thing and you're able to download any premium theme out there if you have any issues whatsoever let me know in the comment section i'll look out for them to help you as much as possible as and subscribe to see more awesome video like this from me i'll see you in another tutorial and until then stay safe